Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I do unboxings here. Mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, and even a dash of Disney. So if you like unboxings, I do hope that you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And if you're already subscribed, thank you so, so much for being here. For those of you who are not big Disney fans, thanks for sticking with me through these unboxings. And for those of you who are just visiting because you are big Disney fans, I do hope that you'll check out some of my other videos. Sorry I'm so far away you guys, but I had to so that I could actually wear my super cute classic mini ears that have this little yellow flower on the top. So hopefully you can see that little yellow flower most of the time and hopefully you can still hear me. Today I have Main Street Mail which is an awesome new personalized Disney subscription and I mean personalized. It is one of the several subscriptions that I get where you get to put in your preferences in so so much detail. Right now they have two main offerings. They have what I get is Mickey's pen pal which is $60 a month plus shipping and then they also have the castle correspondent for a hundred dollars and I think that always guarantees you at least one more item I think in the Mickey's pen pal you get like four items and then probably like five items or more in the castle correspondent and some of you know I have been saying that my birthday is in August but a lot of these Disney subscriptions come towards the end of the month so I will probably be upgrading to do the castle correspondent subscription so that I get a nice big box for the beginning of August so my July Disney boxes will be a little bit bigger and closer to my birthday than if I waited to do an August box so let's get on into it I think that what they're doing is awesome every one of these Disney boxes you guys has kind of a different feel to it so I know some of you have asked me like which is my favorite one out of the three that I get and honestly they're all very very different and as long as you're really good about keeping your preferences updated you shouldn't get too many repeats or too many things that you don't like and I just I love so far the variety of these different boxes so let's get on into it it is pretty hefty and I will say that their shipping is a little bit pricey so far the shipping has always been like between 15 and 16 dollars so hopefully as they get a little bit bigger and have more subscribers they might be able to find a little bit more of a cost-effective shipping method so that they wouldn't have to like I would be fine if they sent this to me in a like USPS uh, flat rate box instead of of this one even though it is really cute on top I do like their little their little emblem this one is really puffy um, so when I like scored it and scored all the tape so it would be easy to open it up it kind of like took a big breath in and sort of expanded even more so I'm very curious to see what's in here it's not super heavy so um, so far they've been doing some really cute little like drawings for everyone which I think is adorable so this one is so so cute it's Wally and Eve and I love Wally it is one of my favorite Disney movies I just recently watched it and it's just so cute and I love all of the new Wally merchandise that they're coming out with there's like a new lounge fly backpack which I think is adorable and it just says Noelle we worried we missed the mark just a little with your first box hopefully this makes up for it we hope you enjoy it Main Street Mail so I think they're just referring to the fact that I got like a small world keychain which was really really cute it's just small world isn't one of my favorite attractions by no means did they like miss the mark but I think that's really sweet that they're like trying to make it up to me um, I did get those amazing tiki room earrings in that last box which I thought was awesome so let's get into it oh my oh my god <laughs> oh my god this is amazing you guys so there is only one item in this box and oh my god <laughs> I'm I'm speechless I don't I'm it's gonna be a very short unboxing because I can tell you right now there's only one item in the box and I am so Oh my gosh. All right, so some of you know, if you are a Disney fan, that they have been doing these limited releases called Mini the Main Attraction, and every month they come out with a series of items. There's some pins, there's usually a lounge fly bag, there's always ears, sometimes a mug. So they come out a collection that is inspired plush, always a Minnie Mouse plush, uh, inspired by one of the attractions. And last month was the Tiki Room, and the Tiki Room is one of my very, very favorite attractions. It's one of the few releases that I did did sit on my computer trying to get something. I also did it for the Pirates of the Caribbean release. Um, and I was on there for a full half hour just clicking. I actually managed to get things into my cart and I wound up with nothing. So I've been so sad like watching all these people do their unboxings of their shop Disney hauls showing up. You know some people have been awesome and doing giveaways of the items that they got. 
Um, the one item that I really wanted, I mean, I would have loved the ears because I'm apparently an ear collector now. The one item I actually really, really wanted was the Loungefly um, mini backpack. And that is what they sent me, guys. This is, this is amazing. So they sat online just like everyone else and got the amazing Tiki Room backpack. And this backpack, you guys, was $75 plus shipping, so I was prepared to pay my $85 for that. By the way, this box, again, is a $60 box. So talk about value. I am totally fine with spending the shipping that I've paid. Um, they knew because I like told them in social media on Instagram, I was like, oh my God, I'm so jealous. You guys got the backpack. I like wanted it so badly. I thought like maybe like deep down they might like take pity on me and send me the ears, but it turns out they didn't actually get the ears. Um, that in no, no way did I expect them to send me this $75 lounge fly mini backpack, which by the way, you guys on eBay, cause I've been like stocking it on eBay. It's going for like $250. Like it starts at $200. Um, and I was just like, yeah, I guess it's not meant to be, even though I love it. Let me show it to you. So, so cute. It's got this kind of like um, bamboo detail, but it is in that like faux leather, like everything else. This super bright lime green print. And then we've got the little ears with all of the little parrots on it. It is so cute. And then you can kind of see like the texture on this bow. It's almost like, um, like a Bottega Veneta bag. Um, and then we've got this like burlap detail on the side pockets, which we all know by now are not for water bottles, but maybe your phone if you're feeling brave. It's like the classic mini backpack shape where it's got this front pocket where the zipper kind of is down below the top of it. So it does make it a little bit difficult to get into. So you can't really put a lot in there. I usually wind up putting like my um, extra charger in there if I am using it as a park bag. Um, this I, I don't know what to say. Like, I, I feel like I'm dreaming. I feel like this is me dreaming that I'm doing this video and I'm gonna wake up and be like, oh, I have to like film my Main Street mailbox today. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Um, and then it's just got these four screen straps which are adjustable. So this is my probably sixth lounge fly bag. This is my third uh, lounge fly mini backpack. I also have the mini backpack that matches these ears. And then I have the Dole Whip mini backpack which was the first one that I bought but this is I just I don't even know what to say I like can't wait to finish filming this so that I can write to them on Instagram and tell them thank you and that they can have my firstborn child which I'm not having kids but I would give them that oh my gosh so let me pull out all the stuffing so that I can show you the interior lining which Knowing lounge fly will be awesome. Let's not pretend I haven't like looked and seen what the interior lighting looks like online. <sighs> wow. Okay. So we've got some desiccants in here. So here is the lining. They've got those really long tags, which I know this is a collector's item and and all, but like I, I cut the tags off of my ears and I feel like I might cut the tag off of the inside of this because I don't want it like rolling around. But I actually love this print that's just in two colors. It's almost like a brocade looking thing, but it's also flowers and the parrots. It's pretty much like the print on the outside, but just in two colors. Like that would make an amazing uh, dress shop dress print. Uh, wow. Wow, wow. Wow, wow. I, ah, I'm so happy. I'm so, so happy. Um... It's a little bit different. It's always a little bit different than what you expect. So I didn't expect this to actually be like burlap like that. Um, I didn't know that this was like the detail, like the texture on the bow and along all these dark green um, bits. And I didn't know that it was like, honestly, I didn't know it was like this bright of a lime green, but it's okay. It's like got such like a, like tiki classic, like Hawaii vintage feel to it. I love it so 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 much um i don't know how i will ever like get this like topped because again like they got one and they decided to make my day make my week make my life and send me the one that they spent time online trying to get just like everyone else <sighs> i am so happy you guys i my disney life is complete 
Now I just need the parks to open up and to get some Dole Whip in my hot little hands and take like 20,000 pictures of myself with this backpack. I'm so happy. Wow. Okay, so I'm definitely, definitely, definitely going to be upgrading for next month for July uh, to their Castle Correspondent. Like I said, I don't know, I don't know how um, they could ever top this because they are not making any money on this particular box of one item. They're just doing it because they love to make people happy, which how amazing is that in terms of a subscription service? They're just doing it because they know that I really wanted it and that it would make my day and year. This this is like my birthday present already. I feel like I've already gotten my like Disney birthday present and probably nothing can top this, but I would love to see everyone try. I would love to see all of the boxes try. Let me know what you guys think about this. Let me know if any of you are collecting any of the mini main attraction items, uh, what your like sort of grail item is. If anything, this was like... I just heard the term grail item and this this was it for me and now I have it. I, I hope it's always that easy when there's like one thing that I have my heart set on. Oh, dreams do come true, you guys. Thank you so much, Main Street Mail. I love you. I wish I could hug you, um, mask or no mask. I love this. Thank you guys so much for just watching me ramble on about one single bag. If you like this video, please do give it a thumbs up and hopefully I will see you all very, very soon in my next unboxing.